Hi, it's Aideen here with another quick tip. This one is for anyone using their voice for meditating for mantras. So one of the things I do in my business is I teach a mantra class twice a week. And I love it. I love mantras as a way of meditating because it helps me stay focused. Meditating in silence can be really hard. I don't know if you've ever tried that. So here's my tip though, if you've ever tried to sing a mantra like OM for instance, here's how you can get more from that, more, uh, be more engaged with it and feel it more. One thing we often do when we sing is we think of it as pushing the sound outward and we're thinking of it more as something others hear. But in particular, when we're using um, our voice for meditation, it's not so important that anybody hears you, but it is important that you feel it. So we're gonna think about how the sound feels as you create your sound instead of pushing it forward. So here's what I'm gonna suggest. We're just going to breathe in really gently, maybe widening your back a little and release. And as we say um, we're going to pull that tone in. Sometimes the um is spelled A-U-M, aum, aum. So if you haven't done it that way, that could help as well. We're going to think of it in kind of a longer thing. Instead of um as being quick, we're going to go aum, okay? So try this with me. Um, hopefully you'll be able to hear it okay. Sometimes the microphone doesn't pick it all up. But imagine you're joining in with me and you're pulling that sound firstly into your chest, then into your belly, then into your legs. So the first one we'll do is into the chest, okay? Om. Beautiful. Now let's try and bring it deeper into the belly. Om. Good. Let's go all the way down into the feet. Om. Are you starting to feel it? This time let's close our eyes, relax our shoulders, and go. Om. This time focusing on all the way down, bringing it inward through your mouth into your belly. Om. Beautiful. Next one we're going to bring all the way down through the chest, belly and into the feet and legs. Om. feels good to me. I hope that you felt that within your body. Keep practicing it. Do at least 10 ums in a row. You'll really feel the benefit of that. It can be really good to do first thing in the morning and last thing at night. If you're interested in mantra classes, let me know. I'm here for you. And um, just tune in. Go in deeper as you do your mantras. And if you have a mantra that you do in your yoga class, Maybe try and feel it more in your body, in your chest, belly and legs is what I would suggest, pulling it inward. Thank you and I will see you next time.